The Google Question Hub is a new tool from Google that has just come to the United States. What it allows you to do is find unanswered questions that Google needs the answer to. This is incredibly powerful because it allows you to create the answers to those questions so that you can get ranked and start getting in traffic for those queries. In this video, I'm gonna walk you through everything that you need to know about the Google Questions Hub and how you can use it for SEO. Let's go ahead and dive into it. Make sure to give this video a like so that you can get more updates on digital marketing news and strategy in the future. Okay, so is it really up to the hype? Well, one of our digital strategists said this, with the incredible insights and reporting offered, this tool has the power to change content marketing. That's directly from Seth Kluver, and we are going to see if it really lives up to it. Let's take a look at the tool. Okay, first thing you need to do is sign up. So just head over to the main page and click the sign up link in the upper right hand corner. Then you'll need to grant Question Hub access to your Google account. That's okay though, because Google's running the show, right? And we generally trust Google uh, to look at these type of things. Next, pick the website that you'd like to use. If you have more than one website that you'd like to use, that's okay, you can pick more than one. Pro tip, you can actually only select verified Google Search Console sites though. So make sure that the site is verified in Google Search Console, otherwise you won't be able to select it. Once you've selected a site or sites, click next, then pick the language and country combos. And then you get to decide if you want email updates and you want feedback from them, do whatever you want. Click get started and now you are in Google's questions hub. So you're gonna select topics by clicking on the squares most relevant to your brand. Then select specific subjects for questions. When you do that, you might think nothing happened because nothing is obvious right away, but something did happen. You got questions added to your list. You can view those questions by clicking on the done button in the upper right hand corner. Then you'll see a list of questions in what looks like an email interface. If you see a question you'd like to tackle on your blog, go ahead and do so. Remember, people are searching for that specific question, so you have to make sure that you include that specific question in your content. Once you've published the answer and the question, then you're gonna go ahead and go back to Question Hub. You're gonna select the question by checking the box next to it, and then you're gonna select the answer button. You're actually gonna paste the URL of your content into the box, and then you're gonna click submit. Boom, you just told Google that you've answered the question. Although this is new, I think that this represents an amazing opportunity for content marketers. That's really it for the Google Question Hub. You can see all the unanswered questions, you can write the responses on your website, or you can find other content that you've created in the past that answers it. You can go in there and then you can submit, and then you can get that content in front of Google so that they can evaluate it and decide if it is the best response to the questions that people have around the content. Have questions? Leave them below. Like, comment, subscribe. Can't wait to see you next time. Bye.